Hey guys, so I um, found this notebook with some ideas that I had for videos um, from like last year and I never made them. And so this one says, story time about telling my bus driver my name is Easy E. <laughs> and I'm gonna tell this story because like the past few videos I posted, I mean they're dope, don't get me wrong, but I just want something more like funny. I've been getting a lot of support, a lot for me, of support on my past few videos, so like I really want to like start posting like consistently and like often, because it's like really exciting for me. So I'm going to tell you guys a story. Oh, okay, a little backstory about my bus driver, like, <clears throat> sorry sis if you're watching this, but you sucked. Okay, first of all, I was like 16, I didn't get my license until I was 18. And, like, you know, usually people get it when they're 16, and so I was still taking the bus to school, like, all the way throughout senior year. She would just, like, sometimes she'd be on time, but, like, usually she was late, but, like, sometimes she'd be on time, so it's like, you had to be on time, otherwise you'd miss the bus. One time, I'm, like, running to the bus stop, and, because I was running a little late, and I'm, like, running to the bus stop, and she, it looks like she, like, slowed down, even though bus drivers are supposed to stop at every bus stop that they have. She didn't even stop, so I missed the bus because she didn't even fucking stop. Like, I told on her, like, I was so fucking pissed because it's like, dude, now I have to get a ride to school because you didn't even, weren't even doing your job properly. Like, if she stopped, she would have seen me running. Like, I was almost at the bus stop. Like, I saw her, like, drive away, and I was so pissed. Like, I know I should have been there on time, but, like, do your job. Anyways, so, yeah, and then she would just show up, like, 10 minutes late and when it's, like, 20 degrees. I live in New Hampshire, you know, in the United States, in the Northeast, so it gets really cold. And she would just, like, show up, like, 10 minutes late when, like, with the fucking coffee. And I'm like, really, bitch? Like, you had time to get a coffee, but you don't have time to, like, be on time to pick up these kids that are staying out in the cold. So, if you watched my last video where I was talking about college and stuff, um, you would know that I wanted to, like, drop out of school my sophomore year, or my sophomore into junior year, and this is when this took place, um, my junior year, and so I was like 16 at the time, maybe 17, I think I was 16, and I was really like rebellious, and I was like wanted to be a rapper, and I was like really against the system, like, well I still am, but like I was like really like, like now I like understand that like I need to kind of be a part of it, cause like I need money, and um, cause I don't know how to farm because they fucking didn't teach anybody, but anyway, one afternoon, like kids were like being obnoxious, like I forget what was happening, but they were just being obnoxious, so she pulled over, I got annoyed, like because I just wanted to go home, like this was in the afternoon, and then the people around me were like, I have work, like I have to be home, like I have work at like three or something like that. Like as she's pulled over, I started being really obnoxious, which I shouldn't have been like this, but I was. I was like really into like uh like easy e <laughs> and, like fucking Dr. Dre. And I was like just like being extra. So I was just like standing up and yelling, fuck the po like you know that part in the song where it's like fuck the police ran said it with authority. So my name is Corinne, so I was like Fuck the police, Corinne said it with authority. <laughs> and like, I just kept saying that. And like, stuff like that. Just being super obnoxious. And when I got off the bus, <laughs> she asked me what my name was. And I was like, Easy E. Like, I did ask her my name was Easy E. And she's like, How do you spell it? And I like spelt it out for like E A Z Y E. And she's like, Okay. And <laughs> she like let me off the bus. Like, didn't like question me or anything. So I was like, LOL, like this bitch really thinks my name's Easy E right now. The principal, like, somehow found out it was me. I don't know how they found out. Like, <laughs> she probably described what I looked like. She probably, like, looked at it afterwards and was like, Are you fucking kidding me, Easy E? This one principal I had was really chill. So, like, I used to, like, be, like, a little troublemaker. Like, I was always skipping class and stuff like that. And, like, so, like, the administration at my school, like, knew me very well. Um, I'm gonna change her name to Miss. Clapton. And Miss <laughs> Clapton, if you're watching this, I love you. But so Miss Clapton was like, really? Easy E? <laughs> she saw me and I just started laughing. And I remember this like so specifically. I remember she pulled me out and was like, Easy E, really? And I was like, okay, like you don't think that's funny? Like you don't think that's funny? And <laughs> she's like, okay, I do, but that's not the point. <laughs> Yeah, I was like, bro, like, she fucking, like, I think I was just bitching to her about her, and, and like, I don't think I ended up getting in trouble, and Miss Clapton ended up calling me Easy E for the rest of her time working there, like, she just thought that was so funny, and I just think that's so funny that I literally, like, told her my name is Easy E. No regrets, but I wouldn't do that if I was in school now, like, 
by the time I got to my senior year, I was like, all right, I'll be respectful. Like, I know these teachers just want the best for me. They don't know what the hell's going on. Like, I'll just be nice. And yeah, like, thank God I didn't have her as a bus driver that next year because she was horrible. Like, I'm pretty sure we were like almost late to school because of her. And it's like, bruh, like, bruh. Like, I understand sometimes it probably wasn't her fault because they there were problems with the buses, but like, don't show up late with Dunkin' in your hand. Like, you look so stupid. Like, that would piss me the fuck off. Like, I would text my mom literally every single time. She pissed me off. One time I wrote out this little piece of paper to give, like, with times and dates and stuff like that, <laughs> to give to my vice principal to try to get her just switched. I didn't want her to lose her job, but I just wanted her to get fucking switched to a different bus route because I did not want to deal with her. But, you know, in reality, I'm pretty sure she's probably a miserable lady and I should just be nice. Anyways, uh, starting to get into this YouTube grind, y'all feel me? If you guys have any like topics you want to talk to me about, I'm really into conspiracy theories and I'm very opinionated. So um, if you want to hear me talk about, I don't like, I want to make a video about like all the basic conspiracy theories that like everyone else has already made videos on, like 9-11. I would love to make videos, but I just like feel like everyone already has talked about it, but I like would love to talk about MK Ultra. Like, if you like have any like, if for some reason you like want to hear me talk about something, want to hear my opinion, let me know, and I will totally like make a video about that. So, like, thank you to everybody who's been like supporting me lately. Like, I freaking like love you guys, like my friends and like everyone else. Like, just like, it's like really exciting for me because like it's been like my dream to be a YouTuber since I was like 12. But like I never made YouTube videos because I was like insecure. And then like finally I started making YouTube videos, but then I did had no idea how to edit. So it's like I have one video. Like I used to just post videos straight from my phone, like no fucks given. Did not edit the, anything, just uploaded that shit straight to YouTube. And I privated all those videos because it's like kind of embarrassing because like I know how to like use a computer now and like if you want to watch like the one video that I have from like last year or something like that I think it's coming up on like two years ago um it's like down there it's the one about Kanye West that's a pretty good one actually I didn't delete that because that's like my most viewed video and I'm like kind of happy with it and I think I was so funny back then like I don't know and then um yeah so this was kind of like a more like lighthearted, funny video so if you guys want more fucking stories, I got plenty. So, like, thank you so much for watching. I'm gonna stop rambling now. Um, yeah, so, bye.